The best features of the 2022 Subaru Forester. Subaru's Forester is a much-loved SUV. It might not be the very best SUV, but it's so reliable and reasonably capable in every category, that it's like the Ford F-150 or the Honda Accord. It just works. Starting at $25,000, the car occupies the compact crossover tier, and competes with cars like the RAV4 from Toyota, with a focus on lifestyle and reasonable off-roading ability. Although it won't be offering Land Rover Defender levels of off-road performance or sports car levels of acceleration. This car began its life around 1997 and was one of the first car models to the crossover party before that became a thing. It was historically based on a Subaru Impreza and has always used the boxer engine with four-wheel drive. The Subaru Forester is a good companion and a good all-rounder. Where the Forester excels is in its ability to offer almost everything you might need in an ordinary situation. That means it looks rugged but understated, the cabin is attractive enough, there is a lot of equipment as standard and the engines are adequate. For that $25,000 entry price you get access to the 2.5-liter motor, naturally aspirated and in a boxer configuration, CVT automatic gearbox, all-wheel drive and torque vectoring, the C-Drive intelligent drive system and hash 40, selectable drive modes and hash 41, plus the EyeSight safety suite of features and 17 inches wheels. Dynamic LED lights, 6.5, smartphone compatible infotainment, automatic climate control, plenty of storage and amenities, plus utilities like hill assist, high beam assist, and keyless entry are just some standard items. It has an attractive cabin and dashboard, with a modern and easy to clean set of materials and fabrics. The design in general is good, although it lacks a little character and cohesion. The engine is adequate with 182 horsepower and 176 feet lb of torque, with around 30 mpg advertised fuel economy and enough power for most journeys, it can also pull 1,500 pounds and up to 3,000 pounds in the range topping trim. Subaru Forester is a good crossover SUV compared to the usual rivals. There is a hybrid option, connected to the 150 horsepower 2-liter engine which offers 16 horsepower from the electric module alone boosting efficiency and power, but the 2.5-liter with 182 horsepower remains the better bet. Going further up the range, to the top, you will be spending $35,000 but for that, you end up with the fully loaded touring trim. Highlights include 18 inches wheels, panoramic moonroof, heated windshield wiper and mirrors, heated seats and steering wheel, bigger 8 inches screen, leather trim for the seats and cabin, premium audio system, and more. Toyota's RAV4 starts at over $26,000 and is slightly less practical with less cargo space and only two-wheel drive, hardly a good start for an off-road focused car. From there, the RAV4 picks up speed, because it has an 8-speed automatic trans instead of the bothersome CVT and the Forester and can tow 3,500 pounds, 500 pounds more than the Subaru. It also has 203 horsepower and 184 pound-feet of torque from a 2.5-liter engine, although these gains are small at 20 horsepower and 8 pound-feet more than the Forester, hardly game-changing. If you were looking at spending around $25,000 though on a crossover with off-roading ability, the Forester has all the equipment that its main rivals offer, with a smaller and less advanced engine range, but with a low price and four-wheel drive out of the door. It just works. The Forester Sport is a great middle-of-the-range option. While the next trim up, the premium adds several features such as Subaru Starlink safety and security and a power tilt, sliding moonroof. The Forester Sport takes the model up to a mid-range standard. This model adds 18-inch black finish alloy wheels as opposed to the 17-inch offering provided with the premium. Beyond that, the Sport comes with dual-function X-Mode with hill descent control, orange exterior accents and badging, blind spot detection, and rear cross-traffic alert, as well as the brand's SI Drive engine management system. This variant is offered in several grays, black, and white. The Forester Sport offers 26 mpg in the city, 33 on the highway, and a combined fuel economy of 29 mpg. It has a range of just over 430 miles for city driving and almost 550 miles for highway driving. With a direct injection 2.5-liter flat-4 engine, the Sport comes with 182 HP at 5,800 revolutions per minute, 
as well as 176 pound-feet of torque at 4,400 revolutions per minute. It has a towing capacity of up to 1,500 pounds. Pricing. The 2021 Subaru Forester Sport is priced at $30,445. By comparison, the mid-range Jeep Cherokee Latitude Lax trim costs $32,370 and the Honda CR-V's XL and X-Hybrid mid-range trims cost over $31,000 each. That said, these SUVs are, on average, more highly rated. Less popular mid-level SUV trims can be found for a bit less, such as the Chevy Equinox LS and LT, being priced at $27,595 and $28,795, respectively. More on the interior and safety. As for in-car entertainment, the Forester Sport comes with four months of satellite radio service as standard, six speakers, a USB connection, and auxiliary audio input alongside a USB with external media control. You also get features such as mirror turn signals, interior air filtration, single-zone front climate control, and adaptive cruise control. Unfortunately, the interior is only available in one tone of gray. There are a whole host of add-ons you may wish to include when purchasing this compact SUV, such as a $418 cargo separator, $132 all-weather floor liners, $52 cargo net, or a $120 rear seat back protector, just to name a few. As for safety, this Subaru trim is equipped with features such as a pre- and post-collision safety system, remote anti-theft alarm system, emergency braking assist, rear door child safety locks, and dusk sensing headlamps. Before looking at the sport trim of the Forester, let's break down the model as a whole. Firstly, the base trim provides a range of entry-level key features that are also present in the more expensive options such as the premium, sport, and limited models. These features include driver assist technology, symmetrical all-wheel drive, Subaru Starlink multimedia, that comes with Android Auto and Apple CarPlay integration, and LED steering responsive headlights along with a rear seat reminder system. The Forester is not the best SUV on the market. Its acceleration times are not the best, its exterior styling is quite simplistic, and the base model is lacking in quite a few areas. However, it is still a particularly good option for young and beginner drivers, and it's fairly roomy too and comes with 76.1 CU featuring of cargo space. But, with that said, what about the sport trim in particular? 